you know, this focus on health inequality isn't going to go away. And the people who are most affected, I think so services that are not efficient and effective are bad for everybody. And uh, it costs more money to do it badly than to do it well. Uh, and so we all pay in the end. But but by engaging people with lived experience, especially people like me with lived and learned experience, I think we make these systems more effective, more efficient, uh, and then and then we're making better use of resources. It starts to free people up to think. We need time out to think and time in to experience and be effective, you know. So it's time in to understand, really. You can't really design a service unless you're involved in some element of its delivery, I believe, and see how it works and engage the people, not just the people who, who are clients, but one way of reaching the clients who receive services and getting their feedback is to engage the community agencies, the service providers, uh, the umbrella groups and so on. And, and it's those discussions that I think are effective in the independent mental health network.